So much shit has happened. So much shit has happened. First off, I did some tattoos that I accidentally deleted. I did some swirly dragons, dragonfly, and I accidentally deleted the footage. I got my fucking teeth pulled. Yeah, I don't know where I left off. It's been a crazy, crazy week. I have to kind of update you on what happened fully. I don't have time right now. I want to just go test to see how my face feels when I ride my bike. I got two wisdom teeth pulled out yesterday. Quite a story on the way to get these wisdom teeth removed. I asked my dentist about riding my bike. She said I should try it. So I'm trying it. A really short, quick, flat ride. A gauge of how my fucking face feels. The bike ride was fine. My teeth feel okay. I mean, my head hurts really bad. Yesterday, I was supposed to tattoo actually and I forgot. So it doesn't happen very often, but I did, I did fuck up. Also yesterday, I got a package in the mail with another pair of New Balances. I haven't even tried these on yet. Just on site, I love this shoe. Like I love the way the shoe looks. I'm pretty sure when the campaign came out, there weren't any actual pictures of the shoe. I'm not really sure. I just have a feeling I talk shit about the concept for seeing the shoe. Then someone put me onto the shoe and I was like, I love this fucking shoe. It's upcycled. It's, I mean, yo, Mountain Dew Zero is actually pretty fire. I drink some soda sometimes now, but it's okay. These joints, I haven't even put them on yet. These motherfuckers. Scrap materials that were gonna get thrown away. The Test Run 3.0. I'm gonna put these on a little bit and find out. It took me forever to find a pair. I found this pair on eBay, 20 some dollars over retail. Apparently that's how everybody makes money these days, selling shoes they can't sell. Finally I came along, made this guy 20 bucks. You only had to hold them for like six months. These shits are dope. If you have a pair of these in 13 and you wanna sell them for retail, I'm your guy. I ain't even tried them on yet. And I'm already gonna tell you I'm gonna love that. I feel like I'm gonna like it. We're gonna see. Just straight, chilling. I haven't felt that great until today, so much that I haven't even tried these shoes on yet, and they've been here for like four days, three days, I don't even know. Brandon's here upstairs. You'll remember him from Japan Vlog, buying a house on the phone, apparently. Alex is playing Mario. No, I'm playing Luigi. Now, the fucking bike is here. The goddamn smart bike is here. Gonna set that up. You didn't see on the vlog, but we bought a Vitamix. We bought a refurbished Vitamix. It broke in two days, so now we have a brand new, a uh, real expensive, Way, way, I don't know what it is to mean kitchen appliances, but we have all of them now. Oh, Kanye pissed on his Grammy. I also released a sticker of Kanye pissing on his Grammy. You should go buy it. It's got free shipping. It's $4. Oh, it's teddy.com. There's also a pre-order for a hot sausage boy. There's, I've been really busy. I haven't even opened up October yet. I mean, I guess, hey, if you wanted to get tattooed in October, hit me up at teddytattoome at gmail.com because it's going to get busy. I mean, a lot of things have happened. The book, book is about to close. It's been dropped. It's almost about to close now. It's just, it's just been crazy. There's the UN party, the event, six year anniversary. So we're about to head down to UN and see what all the hype is about, literally. The one is just resting. First, I gotta put these shoes on, son. I've been waiting days. I've been waiting days to put these on. Do you like Ted's shoes? Go ahead and say yes, because they're fire. Sick. See, she knows. She doesn't mean that. The question is, do they Velcro around my big ass foot? Nope, they don't. It makes sense, like why would they make that that tight? You're rocking it loose, son. It's so weird too, because not like the opening is huge. I don't know why they didn't put a piece of Velcro like right there. Guess we'll find out down at the Hype Emporium, dog. What do they look? They look like something. Just, they look like fucking amazing. Unstrap. Maybe that's how it rolls. Huh? We go by foam runners today. What you want to know about this unstrap? What the fuck are y'all doing? It's all right. It's my style, bro. It's my style. I leave it hanging down. Look. Oh. Ugh. Nah, we're New Balance boys. New Balance, new balance boys. all day. Don't, don't front. Super deluxe rig. <laughs> we're heavy too. Yeah. Breaking my back. I'm wearing 
That shit you can't get, dog. Here, let me put you can't get these? Let me put that. Nah, son. I wouldn't want these. Woo! Why, would I, why do I want these? Pete, look at them, dog. Dude, First looks, off, we're recycling out dude, here. Dude, it looks Re like... Recycling. Trash in the trash. It looks like a three-year-old nah. designed your shoe. Whatever. If this shit was for fucking a Dorkenbecker or whatever the fuck, y'all be all over it. Dorkenbecker? Yeah, y'all be, all, be, all, be, all, be wow. all over it. Y'all be all over it. Yeah, if that was more Travis Scott colors... Yeah, if it came with a side of barbecue sauce, you Is motherfuckers should be all over it. Is this more comfortable than uh, the Yeezy Dolphin? I'm just saying. They look alright. The Tessera 3.0. Ugh. They look like they're still being tested. They are. The strap doesn't even connect. They're testing the boundaries <laughs> of what colors should be combined. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. They were flipping you all be talking about. Hey, though. you know he's a power reseller now, right? He's not. He's still I, in the hole. I was just checking. I think the 11.5 that went out the door was one of mine. I just... Yup. And he sold two shoes today. Oh, shit. Yeah. Two today. Yeah. Yeah. He did say at 14. Yeah, but he sold eight of the 14. Yeah, in the yeah I get it. But that doesn't make him a power reseller. That makes your store <laughs> busy. No, <but laughs> he he had no part in it. He had you. Part. He had you. the hardest part. Yeah. The, hardest part. the camera? Well, he's got to edit the video. <laughs> this guy. He, he doesn't even care. He doesn't even think the money's real. It's not he real money. Goes, I'm not really hurting if it doesn't sell. See, you're getting line twisted. I have no problem with that. What I have a problem with is him getting online saying he's the best reseller in the world. He's gonna be. He's not gonna be. And you have to start somewhere. Next week, he's gonna be playing Pokemon even, Go. Even this of resellers and, and anything uh -huh. suck at one point. Yeah, I get it. But he was also the number one cyclist. He was gonna learn Japanese. What else we got? Uh, the first day he came to work for me, he came in a Lance Armstrong like bike suit. Oh yeah, the, I know. Like, yellow, but it like, says Earn Strong on. Earn Strong. Yeah, yeah. Except he doesn't really ride his bike like he that. The irony yeah. is, like, they didn't even show up in that jersey. He's making that up. <laughs> oh, he actually has I know, one. I know. <laughs> I was like wood? Is it laser carved or whatever? Oh, that's dope. That is sick. Oh, not these. Yeah, those. Oh. They're sick, dog. These are not dope. Bro, what do you mean? That's the most creative shit Nike's ever done. Well, putting a waffle on the bottom of the shoe was the most creative thing. Well, paying $20 for that swoosh was the most creative thing they ever did. By far your favorite dunk of all time. For sure, only because you made it. Right? And then the swooshes come off. Oh, dang. And then the back of it has a six. I got you, dog. Peep game. Are these on a base model? Or they're just yeah. Oh, the reveal. It's like uh it's like uh what's that sports movie? That's dope. That's sick. The box is super sick. I mean, this is a Nike dunk, so it's sick enough. What SB is this on? Levi Dunk. Congratulations. Hey. <laughs> that thing's cool. If you actually want to look at some of the pieces are right here. No zoom, no zoom. And I watched the kid put the shoe on and it was my Air Force One. And I go, in other news, I just sold that 11 and a half Air Force One. Nice. This shirt's pretty cool. In the sense, like, this is an old school print, but he decided to put that on the back of here and yeah. pick the color combos and brought back the old J-Class jacket. Yeah. I'm into him. Bruh. And they gave it the off-white fucking... That's bad. Stinky. Oh, wow. Like, way different than I anticipated. I'm gonna try him. Buy him, dog. No. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's got yeah, Fortnite. We're not on my camera. Spend no Fort, expense here, but for Fortnite chat, yeah. <laughs> yeah kind of he bought a three thousand dollar lens and he's rocking yeah. Fortnite headphones. I think that even wearing the headphones, but hearing the audio in here against the music, I gotta do it. Yeah, you're taking it so seriously these days. It's crazy. I, I, yeah. It's like crazy. When when Erm was filming for me, it was like this. He's like. <laughs> it's because I didn't have this nice back oh, weight. Dog. Oh, okay. I got yeah. you. Yeah, imagine carrying that around Japan, you fucking fuck. Stuff like that. It's, not good. <laughs> it's for standing around for nine hours. Yeah, I don't know. I gotta, I gotta charge it. It's a movie, dog. It is a movie. It's a movie. I'm gonna go bet on the finals. I won 600 last night. Dude. On what? Stupid shits. It's our anniversary. We go to play blackjack. They go, oh, I'm sorry, sir. Your wife can't watch. You know, there's a limit per table. We're the only it's people. It's like some cuckold shit right yeah. here. Yeah. I go, I go. 
He said yeah. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, you're gambling a lot. Hey, it's not as much as it sounds like. Oh, but... We're just documenting. I mean, <laughs> people can come to their own conclusion there. Yeah, there's a lot, you know. Uh, GoPro. GoPro is trying to get me to buy a fucking another GoPro. I have this one that we just got. If you want to buy a GoPro, holler at me. Uh, I don't want to buy the new one, but I probably will end up buying it. PS5. Don't want another thing that I probably don't, probably shouldn't buy. Don't really need. And all the new games that are going to be the same as the games that came out last year that I'm going to complain about playing are going to be on the PS5. So if I'm going to complain, I guess I'm going to complain in the highest definition. People are reselling PS5s, of course. It's not even worth talking about or arguing about anymore because, you know, what I'm starting to realize about life is that it's just, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. No one cares. It's okay. What are we even talking about? We're going to place a sports bet. A bicycle for old Brandon here. Brandon wants to go on an early morning ride. There's a faux leather jacket. There's a what? There's a faux leather jacket I really want for $20. Okay. All right, I got you, boo. And unfortunately, there's a broken part. I mean, I can fix it, but I feel like Teddy's not gonna. Especially, please. However, I'm not gonna let it get me down. I'm gonna continue to do my best to put this together before it gets back. I got this. for the 5 a.m. bike ride. Damn, the whip. Nice. Friday night. I just got done tattooing. It has been insane. I'm tattooing tomorrow. I'm tattooing the next day and the next day and the next day and the next day. The bike is put together. Brandon has gone home. We're waiting on Alex. We're gonna go get pizza because we're fucking starving. We bet on the Nuggets to win tonight. So we gotta make sure the Nuggets win. Put on the Denver Nuggets? I did. Still testing out the best shoe that's dropped ever that doesn't really fit me but still was amazing. I was telling Brandon, if I was gonna make a shoe, it would end up looking just like this. I described this to him in Japan. He's like, what kind of shoes you make? Stretchy and have straps and Velcro and here we are. All right, let's go. Got the pizza, got the cash. You know how we do, dog. We win. We win. Nice. How much money? $12? The smart bike is here. I'm excited about it. It seems cool. My head, the last few days, I've really felt like Magneto with no helmet. Professor X is just drilling my shit. Mm. But it does feel better. Today I feel a lot better. My headaches aren't nearly as bad. I'm starting to get like back in the swing and working has really helped. Super busy. I got these toys coming. I got socks and work that are almost here. Neck gators are almost here. Like we're keeping busy, you know? We're keeping super busy. It's starting to cool off in Vegas. We're gonna start being able to go out more. Great. It's only a hundred today, which isn't that bad believe it or not. The thing that people are gonna ask me about is this New Balance, and we've been talking a lot of shoes lately, and I, I ain't trying to fuck around and end up with a crazy collection again, but this shoe I really love. I'm gonna go through it really quick. It's the Test Run 3.0. It's real true to size. This Velcro strap does not strap for me. Kind of a bummer, but I don't really care, but this should be longer. In fact, if this was made of an elastic at one piece, it would be amazing. Just thought. Scraps that we're gonna get thrown away. Each color is fucking different. Fresh foam, not boost, but it's pretty fucking close. It's close enough and you know what fuck adidas well not fuck you know what adidas i'm sorry i don't mean fuck i'm over it you know what i'm saying like i get it i'm over i'm over it i'm over it i have some i have to boost i like them i will say the collegiate pack the az's look nice in person you know it's like everybody sometimes i guess anyway uh everything that i would put in a shoe i said it multiple times not on camera i don't think but this is basically like a shoe that i would i would make my shoe like this and a lot of people don't like it which makes me like it even more which isn't the same as not liking like the Avril Lavigne ones, the biohacks. I like this because it's got everything that I like in it and people are overlooking its greatness. No one gives a fuck about this shoe. Nobody. 
I give a fuck probably the most. You know, maybe there's some guy out there who gives a fuck more, but I really like, I really like this shoe. Um, I would love to get more colors of it because each fucking one is different. I went on eBay right now for $150 or best offer, and it's the most fire color. It's so sick. It'll be sold after this video, I bet. But it's sick. This shoe is sick. It's extremely true to size, obviously, because I can't even close this fucking thing, which this is really, like, this is a tight fit. What were y'all thinking with this? I mean, I could attach a piece of Velcro to the very end of the suede. Just fine like that. That's pretty hard. Nothing wrong with that at all. But yeah, these are super sick. I love them. I really love, love, love this shoe. I don't have anything else to say. It's a great, it's a great fucking shoe. I like the goddamn shoe. It's great. My favorite shoe I've gotten in these last few shoes. Even though I really like all these other ones. The bodegas, all this stuff. New Balance has some nice stuff. I was going to try and get the Packer 992, but I don't think that's happening. I don't think that struck fast enough to try them out, but it's okay. Maybe we'll try something else in the future. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. You know what I mean? Does anyone really even know what the fuck we're doing anymore? No, they don't. King Kong, people keep asking. Yes. Some people are asking to buy the original. You want to buy the original? You can buy the original. It's in the thousands. Like, 6,000. So, if you want it, 6,000 bucks, it's yours. But... If you don't have 6,000 bucks and you're not just one person because, you know, we, only one person can buy the original. Because of that, yes, there will be prints just like the Godzilla and there will be clothing just like Godzilla, which will be coming to everyone in the world at the same time. Friends and family is just going to get a better deal because that's the fucking deal, dog. You know what I'm saying? I get in with the shit. A time where things are so crazy, it's, it's been fairly busy trying to just get more and more stuff done. I don't know what's planned. I might go back to Colorado the very first of October. I'm not really sure yet. Possible. I need to pick some shit up. I played the Call of Duty beta. It's fairly boring. I thought, I don't know, I mean, it's the same fucking game, though. At this point, I enjoy Advanced Warfare more than any of them because at least it was interesting and different. I know people are not going to agree with that statement, but right. Trump's about to take Fortnite out. TikTok, rest in peace, we love you. Travis Scott, probably going to collab with the fucking coronavirus. Could be a positive play, I don't know. I'm doing my best out here. Hopefully, uh, hopefully things start changing soon. Hopefully, you know, can travel soon. I don't know. This is all the same shit people say, and then some, I say this, and someone says, how dare you, and... There's no point. Again, there's no point. No point. I'm just gonna keep drawing, keep making my food, and sometimes eating pizza, and uh, maybe gambling a little less, even though I'm winning. That's it. That's the plan. Exercise more, sleep more, cover from face face surgery. I'm also not done at the dentist. I'm gonna have to go back. I still have one wisdom tooth left that is underneath the fucking gum. There's all kinds of things that I could probably fix about my face. Other than there's beauty. There's nothing I can do about how beautiful I am. Anyway, that's pretty much where we're at. Uh, no podcast Sunday. There will be one Monday because Dirty Earn, Dirty Earn has expressed that he's just too tired. Sunday he needs the day of rest because he's just, he's been out hustling for too long. The streets are starting to get to him today, but Monday at 6 p.m. podcast and I'll see you next vlog.